This is KNEB.TV Weather from the KNEB Storm Center, your trusted source for weather. Pretty clear here across the area as we go through the evening hours. We're going to be dealing with temps falling down into the 30s overnight. Otherwise, not a bad looking evening at all. We are going to see the winds return though tomorrow and we're going to have really a period of windy conditions here through most of the week to be honest with you. Not much precip coming, temps holding above normal and maybe some changes on the way for next week. 46 yesterday for a high, that's just about normal for this time of year after a morning low of 23. Nothing in the rain gauge. We uh, have had 17 hundredths for the month now. So we're seven hundredths above normal for the month and still running about four tenths of an inch above normal for the year. Well, notice what we've got going on here in terms of uh, the last couple of weeks. We have a couple of days early in this period where we were a little below a normal, back to about normal, then close to normal again on the other side. Then we had some really nice days here in a row, upper 50s to end the month of January. Then we fell quickly as we went into the first two or three days here of February. We fell with temps only in the teens, some 20 to 30 below normal readings, and we got back closer to normal here through the weekend. And we're going to trend that way uh, above normal for a couple of days uh, and then uh, probably back closer to normal and just kind of seesawing back and forth. Temperatures the warmest right here in the middle part of the country. We've got uh, temps mostly in the 40s, even a 50-degree reading sneaking in in Mullen, 52 in Valentine. Winds still a bit gusty out of the west, 15 to 20, gusts up to 30 miles an hour or 40 at times. Looks like wind chills right now are sitting mostly in the uh, 30s and 40s out here across the region. Let's take a look at future cast. Well, let's start first with our bus stop forecast tomorrow. How about that? Get on the bus at 35 degrees and on the way home, it's going to be windy but sunny and temperatures close to 50. Now we get to future cast and it is quiet. Just a few high level clouds. That is it tonight. Winds are going to decrease and it's going to turn out to be a pretty e nice evening into the overnight hours and lows that are going to fall down into the 20s and 30s for most of us. Most of us going to stay actually in the low 30s tonight for lows. So a very warm start to the day tomorrow, or at least for this time of year, mild speaking. A few clouds early tomorrow morning. They'll be mostly sunny skies, though, as we go throughout the entire day. Late tomorrow evening, we bring in a few clouds along with another little clipper system. Going to bring some gusty winds with it in times, maybe a flurry or two, but I wouldn't hold your breath. We're going to see temperatures tomorrow close to 50 for most of us. Our seven-day forecast looks like this. Clear tonight, lows down around 33. Tomorrow, we'll start the day with partly cloudy skies. It's going to be windy. Winds 20 to 30, gusts over 40 temps into the upper 40s and look at our seven day forecast 40s again on Wednesday 50s on Thursday back into the 40s on Friday all those days going to bring some windy conditions 40s on Saturday upper 50s on Sunday and maybe near 60 for Valentine's Day so we start the early part of next week milder I think it'll turn cooler and more active as we go beyond this uh, Tuesday into Wednesday of next week